Hello everybody, it's the Fragrant Jock here with another honest opinion. I hope everybody's safe and well. Um, I know these restrictions are hurting a lot of people. Um, I know if we follow the basics, we'll, we'll get there. I just don't think some of these restrictions are necessary. People are losing their jobs and things. I know there's a lot of people died and my empathy goes out, but... I do think that, you know, we need to get the basics right before we get into these different tiers. Mm. Anyway, right off the subject. Today, uh, the honest opinion is on this one here. It's another doer. <coughs> I purchased this on eBay. Uh, Sentinel, Lon Sentinel London, I think it's called. The, the guy that runs it, he's a really nice guy. Correspondence and communication is really good with him. Um, they've went up slightly in price, you're now paying for shipping about £1.50, so they've went up about a pound odd, so I think this was um, £40, but I think now it's about £41, still cheaper than getting it for the States, because to me it's just far too much money getting it shipped in, so I'm glad they are becoming more available here, and hopefully once um, the company is selling them on eBay is... Uh, Still try to get their site up. Um, once it's up, hopefully that will cut a bit of the cost as well. Um, because, as I say, waiting three, four weeks for it, uh, it's meant to be first class and you're paying, you know, over the odds. To me, as I, I've said it before, and I'll say it again, yeah, there, there are some lovely fragrances that I've got to her, but they're height, they're totally height. And every one of the reviews you see on their site, there's never a bad one. Um, don't get me wrong, there's some lovely fragrances, but um, equally they've got ones that you probably wouldn't buy again. That there are other alternatives to them, and, you know, from Alexandria, Alexandria, or Rosa Salas, or Perfume Parlor, you know, so there's other alternatives there. Um, but this one, Cherry by the Fire, this is uh, Tom Ford's Lost Cherry and By the Fireplace by Mason Mangella. Um, to me, when I first smell this, when I put it on, a lovely smell, but for me there's more cherry in this than By the Fireplace. To me, it just, it's just, that's, that's what you get with this. You get very little of By the Fireplace. Maybe a, a wee bit, but it's mostly Lost Cherry you get in this. But what I tend to do, is I either layer it, I'll put on by the fireplace, or even better, even stronger, Rosa Salas's version, Bonfire. You know, there's not much in this between these two. Um, I would say Rosa Salas is, is definitely stronger than the original. The original's a wee bit softer going on, a wee bit, maybe a wee bit. I don't know, slightly, slightly, not ever, not much, slightly better blended, but obviously it's a lot more expensive. But Rosa Salas is, is definitely stronger than the original. So I tend to layer it because, as I say, what I get out of this is more of the cherry rather than by the fireplace. Um, the cherry just dominates it. Um, but it is a nice fragrance. I mean, as I say, have a look on eBay. Um, hopefully they'll have their site up running soon. This was one of the ones I picked. Because um, Lost Cherry is a lovely scent. Uh, but very, very expensive. Uh, buy the fireplace. You'll get that at a reasonable price if you buy the original. But for me, Rosa Salas is just as good. Um, I tried Perfume Parlor's version as well. Quite good as well. But didn't last as long as um, Bonfire by Rosa Salas. But as I say... Just look at the doers. Uh, don't get don't get sucked into the hype. Um, you'll end up buying maybe too many of them, like I did at one time. Um, they are nice, but I still think they're a wee bit. You know, for thirty mils for forty pound, I just think it's a wee bit steep. Um, you know, uh, presentation wise, there's nothing special. Um, thirty mils is a good size, right enough. If you've got a big fragrance collection. 
but as I say, some of the some of the fragrances are nice, but there's other alternatives, and as I say, totally hyped. Um, they need to drop their prices a bit. They must be, they must be making a good profit for this. Um, I know they say the ingredients they're using is uh, top notch, but everybody will say that. Um, for the price and the volume you're getting, I think they're definitely making a packet for this. But as I say, some of them are nice. This one's is a nice scent. I would say longevity wise, I get about four to six hours out of it. Uh, it was projecting for about one and a half to two hours in this kind of cold weather. So it is a fra it is a lovely fragrance, but as I say, it's more of the cherry. I f nothing of the fireplace, just a wee hint of it comes out. That's why I end up layering it with one of these two. And then it mixes well, because there's just no enough of it by the fireplace in it for me. Anyway, it's just a quick honest opinion. I'm not going to give you notes and things, but as I say, if you're looking for doers, they're definitely available on eBay. Um, have a look. Don't get sucked in. Um, and maybe pick something that suits yourself uh, to your own taste as I say this is one of the better ones Celsius was okay as well it was meant to be an inspired expression of um, Fahrenheit, the original Fahrenheit 1988 one or 1998 I think, can't I remember what date it was um, but they've got some good ones, Scrumptious is nice their Aventus clones are quite nice as well Um the Casino Royale ones, uh, Baccarat ones are quite nice, you know. So there is quite good ones out there. Uh, I would just pick and choose, see what, what's more uh, to you. Black Widow's another good one to do. Uh, if you like Killian's Black Phantom and, and you like Gourmand's, that's a really lovely scent. You'll get that on eBay. That's, that's well worth purchasing for this weather as well. Because Killian are a fortune. Anyway, just a quick honest opinion. I hope everybody's safe and well and we'll get there. Okay, bye for now.